one of the key things is around technology. And that's why Hello Tractor and John Deere are sitting here today. We've been working with Hello Tractor to apply their innovative technologies to support smallholder farmers in agriculture in Africa. Africa is one of the least mechanized regions on earth. Uh, a big part of that yield gap is farmers not having access to equipment. And so we want to play a, a meaningful role in closing that yield gap through mechanization. I think overall technology is having an impact at every level in agriculture. When we look at smallholder farmers, one of the real challenges with them has been getting access to those technologies through the contractors that serve them. Small farmers typically can't afford to have their own tractor. They need to access services through contractors and other service companies that offer those. So by working with Hello Tractor and with the investments that we're making in telematics, we're able to bring that technology to start unlocking value for those customers as well. It won't just be the large customers who can afford to invest in the technology. We're going to democratize that and make it available to everybody. A big part of the work that we're doing with John Deere is to work together to ensure we can meaningfully accelerate the number of tractors servicing smallholder farmers in the market. In Nigeria, the 25 billion is the number that gets thrown out as the amount of new investment needed to close the mechanization gap. In Kenya, where I'm based, the number is closer to $5 billion. So there's a lot of room for new investment. There is a lot of investment that is coming into technology around agriculture. But when you look at smallholder agriculture, there's not nearly enough focused on where the farmer actually is. There are needs on the input side, there are certainly needs on the offtake and, the, and on the business models that are on there, but where the farmer's at, you can make a difference in their lives, a difference in their community, and that's where we need more entrepreneurs like Jaheel focused on ways to, to solve these problems for farmers, because they're there and there's opportunities.